You should pay a fine if you want to get up here. I know the rules I must follow. Daphne? I presume news of Nigel Burbrook's courtship has found its way back to you. I read as much in this scandal sheet taking Mayfair by storm. Oh, Lord Burbrook may be persistent, but he is harmless. No one pays him any mind, sister. I certainly do not, so neither should you. Well, there must be others. Lady Whistledown has all but declared me ineligible. Worthy of the affection of a detestable simpleton and no one else. Tell me, what others should ever want such damaged goods now? Well, you speak as if Lady Whistledown were to be held in higher regard than Her Majesty the Queen herself. You give far too much credit to some anonymous scribbler. These musings, they are not true. Only they are true, brother. And they are true because of you. You have managed to scare every worthy suitor away. Whistledown has merely reported it. You are ruining my chances. I am looking out for you. I am protecting you. It is my duty. And what of my duty? You are not the only one with responsibility to this family. You have no idea what it is to be a woman. What it might feel like to have one's entire life reduced to a single moment. This is all I have been raised for. This is all I am. I have no other value. If I am unable to find a husband, I am worthless. If I am unable to find someone to love me, I am useless. You have rendered me useless to society. Daphne, you are a Bridgerton. Oh, it would be easier if I were not. Well, how can you say such a thing? I believe myself the perfect Bridgerton bride. And you are? No. All I am is an encumbrance. The fact that I'm a Bridgerton is the very reason why nobody wants me. Whistledown has essentially deemed me a counterfeit. Can she be so very wrong? <laughs>